Anybody, uh, we have other things, and they were Clea Landry, Cecile Rawlings, yeah. and the months ahead. I'm going to give them out now so that uh, you'll be able to uh, think about it, and if you don't get local publications or nobody uh, telephones you, that you will know. Uh, August 11th, uh, oh, oh, I forgot October, sorry about that. We're going to go over the whole year with you, and uh, after, later on, he's made up a new listing of names, and there's 20 copies here to give out to them. Oh, no. And because she's a special young lady, today the steering committee wanted to present her with a corsage. And today we present Dorothy Wilson. Oh. Oh. Speaking loud enough, just wave your hand, let me know. Can you hear me, girl? <laughs> um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Bill Reeve, and I'm sort of responsible for this group coming together over the past five and ten twelfths years. It'll be six years in February. Did you like that one? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, and it's really, it's very gratifying to me to, to see a nice turnout like this in this special kind of, of time. Um, this group really is, is, has come a very long way over the, the past years, and I'll save a lot of that for February, but uh, I, I think it's, it's nice to see new people and, and not so new people, and um, it's, it's just a real good mix of folks. Old faces. Old faces. I'm not going to say old. He was a boy. Familiar. Familiar faces. Old people young faces. Right. Old people with young faces. And there's one person whose face we're not going to be seeing anymore, unfortunately, because she's going to be moving uh, off. And she's been a member of the group for a long, long time. And she'll be sorely missed, and that's Eva Brown. And, uh, Eva? So you may not know, but Eva acted as treasurer for the group for quite some time when the group first started that. Public was treating a little well. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Well, and it's also nice to have Lavona back. Lavona, the son of you, may have known him. And had some surgery, but now is back on both feet, and yep. dancing up a storm. Yep. 
Sometimes traditions need to be changed, and that's okay to change them. I think that you folks are well aware that, at, especially at this time of the year, some of the traditions that you may have observed can be very painful to anticipate or to go through. And that may be one of the times when traditions do need to be changed. I think that if we do it with the knowledge that um, we're not forsaking the old, but modifying it to adapt to the new, that we can we can do that and feel okay, not feel guilty uh, about about making those kinds of changes. Just, you know, darling Christmas trees out there. <laughs> No. <laughs>
to share some of these times with you. Um, this is really, you're my family. This is, this, is, uh, this is where it's at. Just wanted to say thanks and, and Merry Christmas and, and Happy New Year and we'll see you in January. Thank you. And thank you, Dale. Special thanks to you, Bill, for getting this started for all of us. Yes. Or we wouldn't have this opportunity to be here. Thank you again. And I wanted to also point out Motor Tops. Motor has done a great job, a super yes. job. That's right. And she deserves a definite round of applause. Well, of course, she does. Pleasure to present you with this beautiful.